We are back here on Girl Talk. We're just organizing, getting things all situated. During the break, we were talking about, um, are these easy to maintain? And I loved her answer to you. You just gotta know what to do in case right. Hawaiian punches on them. <laughs> With all of our leather, we supply leather wipes from Wyman's okay. with a little cheat sheet on it to how, tell you how to take care of leather. The main thing with leather, wipe it down once a week. So if the kid's got some sticky donuts on it, you're wiping it off. The biggest culprit right now for leather, suntan lotion. Oh. Lotions, anything you're putting on your body. Okay. But the biggest culprit is medications. What? If a gentleman had a brown chair, sat in it a whole year, never cleaned it. He had a big orange spot in the back of the brown. It was the medication. A, it was a chemical burn. He was on a high dosage of heart medicine. So anything you're putting in and on your body is going to come out of your body. So and you don't, his head? Hair products, but hair that products. Makes that actually does make sense because it's a natural fabric. Right. So what I tell people is wipe it down. If you want, get a little tea towel of the same color. Yeah. Put it over the back just to give it a little extra precaution. But it's easy enough to keep clean if you wipe it down once a week, you're getting anything off of it. But then put, use leather wipes at like every other month and wipe it all down at night, cleans, protects, and reseals. Are these aniline dyed all the yes. way through? Yes. So an aniline dyed means that the like the color of this mm -hmm. goes through the fabric. Oh, it's interesting. Some, some inexpensive leathers, if you go like this and you, you it'll find, wipe off. Yeah, it, it doesn't wipe off. More like off, a surface. But you, you'll, see the, you'll see the white underneath of it or a lighter color won't be the same wow. color. Okay. So we are having so much fun and Jeremy's in the back and he hasn't <laughs> gotten to sit or push anything or do anything. Right. He's kind of he's, bummed out. Yeah. So he's he's back there asking peanut gallery questions mm -hmm. like, so do you have, can I buy off the floor? How do I get one of these? We sell <laughs> off the floor. Uh, the chairs, the stressless chairs, if in stock in New Jersey, we usually get them in two to three weeks. And I did have a customer coming up from Florida, wanted two by October 1st. They were able to work with me and I'm getting them today. Which is super fast so. right now. <laughs> it is so. so bad, all the shipping and delivery. Oh, it's if crazy. If people are telling you they can't get things, believe them, please have believe patience them. with them. It's the worst I've and ever And imagine seen. ordering something like randomly somewhere and then it, you wait two months and then it, you don't like it or, well, you, know, or you haven't sat on it right you know you know how would you buy something without sitting that would scare me i would but you yeah. know who's suffering are people like um front gate or, or serena and lily or pottery burn or places like that because you know they get such volume it's tough mm -hmm. to get things in which is the beauty of coming here because you basically can get it in the family room immediately mm -hmm. <laughs> and our other products img and bdi Depending on what's going on, BDI is pretty good on keeping stock. We get it quick. But tell people what BDI is. We're gonna. I'm sure Jeremy's gonna have some pictures for us. Baker Design Industry. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, out of Virginia, okay. they do some more contemporary design and woods and and um, veneers and different things. But and they're oh, case goods. Case goods. So you're dealing with home entertainment and you're also doing. Beauty bars, centers. they now have bars. That's the one you were looking at. Yeah, the you're going to go over and look at that. Yeah. Like, case goods like <laughs> not like, soft and smushy. Keep talking. Yeah. <laughs> and then they also do home office. And we've got a whole section set up on the other side of the store. Nice. Oh, those home offices. I are... just really love the consoles in here. And Jeremy, you have to take some pictures of these. Mm -hmm. I, I tell you, they, they are a perfect um, partner, if you will. Yes with the stressless. Um, they all play together and work really well. And I think we've used some of the more, what you're calling like more contemporary or modern pieces, mm -hmm. again, in very traditional design motifs oh, and they yeah. work I beautifully. I think a lot of people do more of an eclectic mix anyway, don't mm -hmm. you think? Oh, I do, I do, I do. And it really works. But I think what I love about those pieces is that they're so beautiful. The last, they have a, you know, it's not just a functional piece. Exactly. The last time we were together, here's the new trendy thing in design. We're so like up on <laughs> trends. That's what we are, trend seekers. Right? We are mm -hmm. trend seekers. I like that. Yes. Learning centers. Yes. Learning centers because so many kids are doing virtual. Mm -hmm. If you look at homes and renovations mm -hmm. and things oh, like and that, you're creating a learning area. area. Yeah. Learning mm -hmm. center. I love that. You've got to walk in. We'll show the, the desk in there mm -hmm. too, which is really cool. That's conducive to learning, comfortable, but mm -hmm. maybe uh, a little niche that you can put your kids in, so that when they, if if in fact they have to learn virtually or you're on a computer, not. I do too. I hope not too. I really but it do. is good to be prepared, and I'm sure it doubles as just a homework spot. Exactly. 
And so the other thing I'm seeing is mm -hmm. instead of having the TV in the living room or over the fireplace, mm -hmm. they are now taking the TV into a possible guest bedroom or over the garage and making a seating area to watch TV in so you're not taking up the living room. More and more and that. more more and more and more because again, the TV, they're trying to separate it from the learning area, which mm -hmm. makes so much sense. Mm. It's super fun, isn't it? it Are it you is. surprised when you walk in and then I'm not gonna get up from here. I know, it's pretty amazing. <laughs> I might it? take a nap. <laughs> Come and visit Savannah Comfort. It's, well, Lynette's great, and your Dennis, your husband's wonderful too, and it's it's great. If you see that it looks like a coffee shop, it's a movie set. <laughs> <laughs> only a day or two. Yeah, only a day or two. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Uh, it was super fun to see you here too. Always thank you all for joining us here on Girl Talk. Please have a safe and wonderful week. Bye-bye.